Hey guys, welcome back to another new video. So in this video, I'm going to review another custom ROM for Redmi Note 6 Pro and this time we have Evolution X ROM and I have reviewed Evolution X ROM for Redmi Note 8 few days back and that was an awesome ROM and for Note 6 also it's similar kind of experience, really good ROM. So let's go and check what we are getting with this ROM. First of all, let's jump into the settings and other things. So if we go to our settings, as you can see, under 13, security patch level is February 5, 2023. Uh, the things are same as uh, all IOSP based ROM. And in this ROM also we are getting the Evolver where you will get all kind of uh, settings to tweak your system UI. Whatever you want, you can change and tweak. And I have showed this one on Redmi Note 8. So that's why I'm not showing much here. And one more thing, which is really important thing, which are included in this ROM is that screen like display calibration setting so this this rom does not come with any kind of xiaomi parts option but it's come with something which can fix your screen retention problem so the previous all the roms i have tried based on android 13 have some sorts of screen retention problem but in this rom if you tweak the display you will not have any kind of issue with that so where we will get so if you go to like and display option so there is option called display color so you go and turn on the display color option and you just set up on 230, 230 and 230. You will not get any kind of skin retention problem. As for now, I have used long time this ROM, about a week now. And I haven't found any kind of issue with skin retention. So it's working really good here. And the thing which is missing here for now is that the Wi-Fi hotspot has no 5 gigahertz band option, which is also missing on Redmi Note 8 and the bugs we ha i have found on redmi Note 8, it's not present on this rom so first bug i got there is about the showing the wrong information about uh rams usage so here you can see 1.2 gig available it's true as you can see 1.2 and it jumps to 1.7 when i close it and it's go about 1.8 gig to free rom uh, free ram so that's quite good actually this rom this rom is really good um the, the RAM management is really good on this ROM too, like I said for Redmi Note 8, so it's really good. And other things about which I have found a bug on Redmi Note 8 is that if you take a screenshot, you cannot edit that. So in this case, we, I did not get that issue here, so you can edit, you, you will not have any kind of issue. So in under 13 based ROM, there is a major issue with double tap to a work, so it doesn't work on most of the ROM. Last ROM I have reviewed for Redmi Note 6. It was um, superior OS which has double tap to awake and it was working on that. But before that, other ROMs did not work. And in this ROM, it's also working. So as you can see, double tap to awake working. And about the fingerprint, it's really fast. You will not have any kind of issue with fingerprint. And I have tried like many scenarios. It does work really fine. And also you can set up like face unlock. You will not have any issue with face unlock. So last time i said super OS is really good rom but it it has like you you have to install um uh, gfs because it doesn't come with gfs and also you, you will not have any kind of like uh bank apps because because you are installing gfs you are flushing gfs so you will not get any kind of bank apps but in this case this rom has um come with like gfs gfs code so you will not have any kind of issue and also you can use bank apps in this rom so as you can see the if you test a safety net, so the safety net it passed, so you will have, you will not have any kind of issue with using bank apps, and it it doesn't come with a lot of apps actually. But the apps you are seeing here, uh, like YouTube, photos, those are I have installed, and also the camera. So so talking about the camera, the it comes with Gcam Go, which does work perfectly fine. You will not have any kind of issue with that. It works just fine, and I have installed another Gcam here that's also working so this gcam i have downloaded from directly from play store so if you want to install gcam you can directly download it from play store and it will work just fine so about this rom actually i haven't found any kind of bugs or issue with this rom after using these days and maybe this rom is one of one of the best rom you can find for note, mean note 6 pro if you are looking for Android 13 based ROM, but if you are looking for Android 11 or 12 based ROM, there are better ROM available, maybe, but I haven't found any kind of issue with this ROM too. It's completely daily driver ROM, no issue, 
nothing else so i've been using like seven days or eight days haven't found any issue and i have watched youtube mostly youtube and other things let's serve the internet and other things but i, have, I didn't play any kind of games maybe you will not have any issue if you play games also because it's really fluent so as you can see it's really fast and fluent you will not have any issue so that's it about evolution x rom i will put the rom link in the description below you can download it from there and flash it so thank you very much for watching and i will see you next time